I don't understand the amount of hate Madam Web is getting because in my opinion, it should be getting more hate. I'm not exaggerating when I tell you that this is not only the worst movie I've seen this year, this is quite possibly one of the worst superhero movies, if you can fucking call it that, of all time. And really, just one of the worst movies I've ever seen put to the silver screen. Like, it's disgusting. I really just want to fucking bitch. Get my money back. Look, I understand it's really difficult to make movies and a lot of hard work gets put into these movies, but I genuinely don't understand how this got approved up the corporate ladder at Sony. This shit gotta be a money laundering scheme. If you told me AI created this entire film, I would believe you. Like top to bottom, there was no direction in this film whatsoever. The script was terrible, the editing was terrible. A lot of the plot lines and decisions make absolutely no fucking sense. I had to look deep within myself and my soul to tell me if this is really the game I love. I had to take a cold shower to get the stench of this one off me. I was 20 minutes into that bitch tweeting because I couldn't believe how boring, generic, poorly edited, laughably bad dialogue, and horrible, absolutely horrible ADR, which if you don't know, ADR is like the voiceovers they add after the fact. And this man right here, the main villain, had all ADR, bro. Like, what was the point of even having him in this movie? Almost all of his lines were ADR. Shit was crazy. But I mean, what else would you expect from the track record of these writers of Madam Web? I mean, look what they've done up to this fucking point. We keep getting that bag, Matt and Burke. Proud of you. But I mean, this isn't even really like a fucking superhero movie, action movie, Spider-Man movie at all. This picture of Elijah Wood doing whatever the fuck this is is a better Spider-Man movie. Yeah, this man's costume? Never explained. Never wore that shit in the comics either. He just got a Toys R Us fucking mask on and said, fuck it. I'm bad for the sake of being bad. A quick little spoiler warning, if you care, about being spoiled about Madam fucking Web. They kept doing teases for uh, Uncle Ben and Peter Parker, who was unborn yet, and it was just the most shameful fucking like are like insulting to the audience like the biggest this is peter parker being born and i shit you not a literal line from this script ben gets to be an uncle now all of the fun none of the responsibility i mean give him up now there are some decent saving grace for this movie like it's actually kind of funny like unintentionally funny like you'll find yourself laughing a lot maybe with this movie but mostly at this movie and dakota johnson she's actually hello funny like low-key and she's been trying to tell us like this entire press tour that this movie is ass isabella merced sydney sweeney and celeste o'connor try to do the best with what they're given but i mean it's bleak man like they're not even really fucking characters they're just there i mean you should really watch this movie to just see how bad it is to believe it specifically you should watch it in imax because that's the only format you should be watching sydney sweeney in. i wish madam webb could have told me the future of not buying these fucking tickets i took them for the damn team y'all better give me a goddamn salute down in the comments and follow not even their shameless horny ass marketing campaign could save this movie i know that when you see Madame Webb, you're gonna love it. In fact, I think you're gonna see it. Hot. That's all I gotta say. Hot.